guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we have the Villainous and the Demon Knight one in one. So I heard about this because a, another YouTuber unboxed this, or not unboxed, she got requested this book, and this man got sent or whatever it was, and she didn't know she was flipping through books and it has some smut things in it. So I was like, okay, I'm, gonna, I, I'm like, mm, okay, I'm gonna see if this is real or not. So yes, I've got the book, and the camera's really wonky, but doesn't matter, I'll go get a new one anyway. Um, but for some reason, this book is like, hang on. So, you know, this is the cover, um, and here's the back tall, dark, and instatable. When a noble woman see, uh, see, see, I'm gonna say CC because that's her name that what she gets called in this, realizes she's been reincarnated into an okay, um, okay. O to me game. Her shock is further complicated by the fact that she's a villainess. Was worse, she can't even change her f seem to change her fate. Now, now her engagement is broken off. The heroine is harassing her, and she's forced to work in a brothel. Where her fir very first customer turns out to be the debauched lo leader of the Imperial Guard, Lucas Herbis. This dangerous Casanova looks like he's been the end of her until he takes her as her fiance. So it starts off with like her with her, her fiance, you know, doing this. And then he seems to be like, no, you do, don't like you anymore, you're horrible, and I like this person instead. The engagement is broken off. So, like, okay, classic kind of crap, da -da -da -da. this other girl that he likes, um, that he's with, um, basically saying that she, like, you know, the, the, the woman that he sees tells that uh, his, his fiance is this other thing, right? So then she gets sent off to a brothel where she will have to basically, you know, do it with other people. And the fact is, when she was younger, she um, met with this guy um, when he was younger because he was fighting. But obviously, uh, no one liked Timmy as much because of his strength. He was a demon. And no one liked that. But obviously, he was young enough to be on their sides. So when he grew up and stuff like that was and he went to himself, I want her to be my queen, I want her to be my fiance, I want her to be mine. And he does, but the fact is that um he decides to take her well, he was the first cousin that she um had in this boss uh, brothel and um next thing you know he's doing stuff to her to basically make her as a fiance to her. And she's just giving in to him, basically, to what he's been done. But it's like, I don't... It's supposed to be, like, an interesting manga, but for me, yes, there is scenes of smut in it, but for me, I wanted more than just, oh, yeah, this engagement's broken off in a few pages, and then next you know, you have her in a brothel doing it with the demon kit knight, and then at the end, um, her in the demon knight's um, palace with hickeys on her boobs you know i'm just like okay i wanted more like how did she become the villainess how did this um, happen a bit more descriptive and like how did he decided to want to make her hers what else did she do like she actually complimented him like oh that's love but i wanted more so i'm not sure if i'm actually going to keep this volume and it's just not what i thought it was going to be it's a good manga don't get me wrong it's just different what I thought it was going to be. So I am probably actually going to be passing it along to someone else instead. It is a good book, good manga, and obviously, yes, you're thinking, I think you haven't got to volume two, but I'm not going to get the volume two because it's not going to be out yet because it's still pre-ordered. It's a pre-order thing that you've got to do. I'm not pre-ordered anything yet. And obviously, I don't, I've read the first book, the first one, and if I don't like the first one or the first two books or whatever I get, I don't like them, I don't get the next books, and I'm not wasting all my money. Unfortunately, I'm not getting this one, I'm not going to carry on getting them, um, but that's fine. I hope you guys enjoyed my review, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace, bye.